That's right, folks. Look what we got going on. Mega stocks out there being bought. And I'm going to tell you this one. This really put a smile on my face. I have told you to go by the actions of the whales out there and not their words. And I'm talking the, the likes of Charlie Munger, Warren Buffett, and none other than Kathy Wood. And we're going to talk about that today. Because old Kathy and over there at ARC made a, a very, very nice purchase yesterday that I loved seeing because we were out there buying before she was buying, which is always the goal of our growth stocks. And so this is one that I wanted to bring to you. Plus take a look at where Warren Buffett has been loading his money up. And we should just, like I said, follow the actions. You want to know the best stocks to buy now, the best growth stocks to buy now. Yeah, you want to know what stocks I'm adding to the old stock mo portfolio? Well, stick around because I think you're going to like what I got for you. Now, first stock I want to just look at to make sure anybody has not taken advantage of this does it. Look at this. This is C3AI. I'm not telling you to buy this one. I'm trying to get it to you for free. And right now you see it's up 200% this year, year to date. And who is giving it to you for free? Well, I teamed up with Moomoo right now and they're giving you one free share of this stock, 30 something dollar stock for free. For You gotta click the link below in the description, put $100 in Moomoo and you're gonna go ahead and get up to five free stocks for free. We're gonna get five free stocks for free worth up to 2,000 a piece. $100 cash reward coupon for $100 off a $1,000 purchase plus a free share of C3AI all for $100. Folks, this is the best return you're gonna get. And of course, you want a free share of Tesla or Google, put five grand in. And I'm telling you, and you still get the free share of C3 AI plus 15 other stocks, man. They get all kinds of stuff. We're running out of time though, it's only till the end of June. So I would do that right now. And it's anybody in the house, 18 or older, sign up, take advantage of it. You can use the link below for each individual account. If you do not use the link, you do not get all that. So you have to use the link. And then of course, Weeble down below, use the link, put a dollar more and you get up to 12 stocks worth up to 30,600 altogether. Come on over to my Patreon finally, and then join us there. And you can hit the Achiever level, 1999 level. You'll get to see the portfolios and be a part of our private Discord. And you can see what stocks I've been releasing and what I've been buying. Remember, I'm always buying. I was buying yesterday as well. So now we get into it. What stock am I talking about? Folks, here it is. Take a look at it. It's SoFi. And you might be saying, what's going on with SoFi? Here you go. Down here, who bought it? Arc. F, Arc F went out and bought yesterday. SoFi, oh, well, they didn't buy a lot, did they? Well, I thought it was a lot. 283,996 shares of SoFi. Hats off, hats off. I gotta tell you, I love that one because I was buying this week as well. And so it's nice to see after all this negativity out there, you see who buying? That's right, Arc. Kathy Wood pulls the trigger. And you can see that it's down to eighteen or eight dollars and eighteen cents. So obviously, uh, you we have an opportunity here to take that knowledge and do what with it what we want. I always say go by the actions. I think Kathy and her team have done a lot of research before they start sinking in, uh, you know, a million dollars worth of stock, uh, almost two million dollars. Well, is it two million dollars? What did we get there? Yeah, it is over $2 million worth of stock in SoFi. So I'm feeling pretty good about that. I like that. But I obviously, I would say you would expect Kathy Wood to say, what's one of the best growth stocks to buy now? By her actions alone, it would be SoFi. How do other analysts feel about this, though? And then we can come over and take a look. And you can see down below here, they have a price prediction. Top analyst on Wall Street at 886. Only a 7% upside potential. Uh, and uh, you can see here, you got a couple different ones though. Over the last, uh, we'll say eight days, 3% down, 40% down, 20% up, 20% up, 32% up. So it depends what side of the coin you're on. Do we short this thing? Do we go long? Does SoFi have a run? Does it not have a run? Here's the deal. And I want to tell you this. A lot of people say, what do you think, Mo? I haven't been buying growth stocks. And I always say, go buy the actions. I have not been loading up on any growth stocks, except... Which one, folks? Those over to Patreon know which one I've been buying. I've been DCAing in every week or two. I like to put a purchase out. I did this week's purchase. It is SoFi. I have been buying SoFi now. It's way down. We got in at the sixes, and I bought again this week a little bit. And I like SoFi for the long run. Why? Because I believe this week coming up, possibly Tuesday, 
the Supreme Court is going to issue their decision. Now, at the end of the day, if they come out and they say everybody gets relief and forget the loans, we're going to take ten to 20000 off each person who qualifies, so be it. So if I still has a deadline, come to October, everybody has to start paying. More importantly for them, September starts to accrue interest again. So everything's going to be back to normal come Q4 for SoFi, and they can get back into that, that business all in. But if the Supreme Court comes out and says all these loans are not forgiven, all this, you know, all this money's not forgiven. Well, that could actually help so far. And with the Supreme Court, uh, I, I don't know. From what I was gathering, from what I'm watching, I believe personally they may lean on that side of not forgiving it. We're not, we don't know. There's a lot of programs out there to help people, but I'm not sure. We'll see how this goes. So if they do not, does that help so far? I would think so. Of course, it would hurt the people that don't get the relief, but it would help so far as a company. And so I'm watching all this, and now you have Kathy Wood buying a couple of million dollars worth before the decision, knowing that she could wait until post-decision to lower the risk. I am not sure how it feels, but I got to tell you, I thought the, the purchase timing on this was very interesting because she could have easily waited till next week, only a couple of days, to buy you know buy these millions of dollars worth. And so I think... She sees the results benefiting SoFi, or maybe I'm just mistaken. Maybe I'm wrong here. Another one that I'm watching that I do not own, but I believe it or not, folks, I am considering buying. Uh, here we go. Take a look at this. It's Hood. It's Robin Hood. And she has been loading up on this. And you're seeing more and more people getting back in trading with them and everything else. And as the markets, and as you can see this year to date, it's up about 17.45. Retail traders, once you see the market start to run up like we have been, look at this. It's up 20% because people are using it more. The retail people want to jump in. They get FOMO. They want to buy. And, and when you see also, on the other hand, you see these, uh, these crypto exchanges getting attacked, going out of business, who picks up their business? And so for some of them, Robinhood gets it. And so you, you have this, and I'm starting to think, Go buy their actions. If you're looking at the best stocks to buy now based on their actions, Kathy's been loading up on that. No, she hasn't. Yes, she has right here. 145,000 shares. Uh, she Right down here, another 95,000 shares. And I know, I think RK had some too. And so you put it together, that's over 200, uh, what do we got here? Right here, 200 and what, 40,000? Plus the other ones go at almost $10. That's over $2 million worth on Friday as well. And so I'm watching this. I'm going by the actions, all right? Is the run over and we go all the way back down? Well, we tested uh, year to date down here around eight and eight and eight. So we know there's some real strong resistance down there in the eights, all right? So it could drop a buck. Maybe it drops 10% here. I'm not sure, but the upside, what's the upside? Whoa, we know what the upside could be if it, and you can see this, it's been, pretty stable here uh, around eight nine dollars and you can see this for a long time here and so I see what she sees you see the stabilization you're probably seeing people come back they're growing uh, when you have this run like we have had what are you talking about Mo well when you go year to date for the Nasdaq up 30 percent people see this they're hearing about it they want to jump in crypto starting to roll again and you see ethereum rolling up again uh, 1890. What do you mean it's rolling up? It's a 57% from the lows in October. I know we got down there around eight something and now we're all the way back up to 1890. So we more than double. So people could run in. So what is the Robin Hood stock price prediction? 1183, 24.66% upside potential. And so I wanted to share that with the audience. And then of course, what about old Warren Buffett? What is his best stock to buy now? I think this is a slam dunk when you look at this one. Why? Because not only is he one of the wisest investors in the world, if he's going to say, look, I have a lot of money and I'm putting the majority, almost half of it, into one company for the long term, that should tell you something. Apple, 46.7% of his money. A hundred and seventy billion dollars in Apple. And I'll tell you this, when you see that, pay attention to it, folks, because that tells you 
that this is one of the best stocks to buy in his mind. It's a 50% year to date. He is killing it. What is the absolute stock price, Apple stock price prediction? It is $191 in the next 12 months, 2.67. Now I said by the middle of summer, and I said this last year of 2023, I would expect it to be around 200. We didn't quite get there, but I gotta tell you, we got close and that to me is a win. So I feel pretty good about that. And everybody else says, oh, it's going down under 100 and this and that. Well, we got close, we did good. And better than that, we did well. We might even still be able to hit it. So that's a, a list of the best stocks to buy. Now, based off of the big wigs out there, the whales, and you can see where they're putting their money. So I did want to bring that out. And how do you guys like the old summer shirt? It's getting, we're in the first days of summer. I thought it would bust out even though it's windy and cold where I'm at. Uh, I have a feeling the weather's going to break next week and get into the 80s and 90s. And that's what I'm looking forward to. So I figure I'd bust out some summer clothes and get ready for it. Now, folks, if you haven't gotten that free share of C3AI and that $100 coupon, please do. Moo Moo, down below, get anybody 18 or older to hit that link, put 100 bucks in. You get all kinds of stuff for doing it. You sign up for the account. You will not regret it. It's good stuff. And then, of course, come on over and join me at the Patreon down below. Or, and get that free stock, get those free stocks from Weeble down there. Take advantage of it. Any deposit at all using my link, you get up to 12 stocks worth of 30,600. And on top of this, folks, all you got to do uh, is join the YouTube community as well. That link's down there too. I appreciate you stopping by. Let's get out there and make some money.